Hey, what's up guys, I'm from BSC Tech. We have a Samsung Galaxy S6 and as you can see, the phone is stuck into boot loop. The reason behind this issue is uh, a bad ROM was flashed on this device. The recovery is there, but the ROM has gone uh, bad and the installation was not successful. As a result, the device is stuck with the boot loop. First thing you need to do is uh, connect a USB charging lead in order to charge the device to at least 50% or higher. Once that is done, you need to move on to the next step, which is to boot into the recovery. And uh, there are two ways out. First one is you can install a custom third party ROM if you have root access or if you don't have root access and your recovery is not there, then you can uh, go for the second method which is to install the official software, which you can download from SAM firmware. So the first thing you need to do is we will try to boot into recovery and see if that's uh, happening. So we will hold uh, volume up, volume down, power and home button at the same time. And then we will hold uh, volume up, power and the home button in order to boot into recovery. So this is not going there. So let's switch this off completely again by holding volume down, power, and okay, this is going into download mode. So now we have to hold volume up, volume down, power button and home button at the same time. This will uh, put the device into force reboot. And as soon as it goes, it's gone into force reboot. You hold volume down, power and home button in order to boot the device into recovery. So guys, remember, volume up, volume down, power button, and then this home button in order to go into a force restart. And as soon as you see Samsung logo, you release volume down button, you hold volume up, power button, and home button. Now we are inside recovery, so we have plenty of options here. We will go inside uh, the wipe section and click on advanced wipe. Dalvik system will wipe these and click back then we will do a factory reset that's fine then click on installation and then we have these four roms which were already on the root directory so we will install uh, lineage os and click next in order to go through the installation process remember guys this is the first phase the second phase is if you don't have root access you can install uh, odin and download the ROM from uh, SAM firmware and then install uh, all those four files directly on your device. Very simple and straightforward unless you don't know what you are doing. You can uh, simply go ahead and uh, on Odin, just to let you know, we have uh, BL, AP, CP and CSC. These are the four files required and uh, you can note down your model. And when you go on SAM firmware website, you can create a free account. It will allow you to download one ROM per user with a limited uh, uh, number of days. Like for example, in one week or one month, you can only download a certain number of files. And that's absolutely free. You don't have to go for a premium account. Once that is done, you can come back on uh, the installation, connect your device with uh, your computer in download mode and flash those files and then it will bring back your phone to life. So this problem which I've shown you at the start of this video was basically caused by a soft break. Unless there is uh, an issue with uh, the memory itself with the physical memory on the device and that causes uh, the reboot, then there's a way out. If the flash memory has gone faulty because of the hard hardware failure, then there's no way to bring it back to life because that is something which is directly connected with the hardware and only a replacement board or a shop can repair that. But uh, in order to fix a soft reboot uh, issue or uh, stuck with the reboot problem, you can simply follow this guide. So by the time we're talking, we've already gone through the installation process and we will click on reboot device. And now the device is going to reboot and load the operating system. So this time, hopefully it should not uh, reboot into the boot loop. So we see this uh, uh, 
lineage OS operating system boot animation on screen, which means the phone is now back in action. And uh, under only a few minutes, we will be able to go through the setup and bring it back to life. So this will fix your problem, guys. Well, stay with the video just to make sure that we are 100% sure on what we have done today. And uh, in case if you are facing problem or you stuck somewhere, you can always come back and ask me. We can see that Lineage OS operating system mood animation logos on screen. Welcome to Lineage OS. Congratulations, your phone is now fixed. We'll just go through the basic phone setup rather than setting up all the way with the Google account. So what was that? So we will just skip all these options on screen just to get you through the basic uh, set of process. Here we have uh, a clean uh, ROM, which is uh, without any doubt the cleanest ROM I've seen. Uh, we have Samsung Galaxy S6, which is now back to Android 13. So hopefully this is solved your problem. Any questions or feedback or you're stuck somewhere, you can always come back and ask me. I'll be more than happy to help you out. Take care. Bye-bye.